Well, hello there, friends. Today we're going to talk about my favorite ingredient. Mm -hmm. Butter. Butter makes everything butter. You know what I say? You never have enough butter. <laughs> Let's talk about butter. But not just talk about how we eat, how we enjoy it. Let's talk about the surprising health benefit of eating and cooking with butter. Let me bring you back to 1976. <laughs> That's when I opened up my first restaurant. French restaurant. By the way, one of the 100 best restaurants in America. All my guests would just love French food. Everybody would leave the restaurant with at least a few ounces of butter, some of them with a little bit more in their system, but everybody was so happy. Ah, oh, those days were amazing. I'm going to say like my parents used to say, the good old days. <laughs> and then came the 80s. All of a sudden, everybody was obsessed with the idea that butter was bad for you. I know what it was, the margarine police was hard at work demolishing the benefit of using and eating a beloved butter. <laughs> I remember my customer asking for sauce with that butter. Imagine that, a beurre blanc without butter, a, a garlic shrimp without butter, a, a lemon sauce without butter, a poached salmon without butter. I would have a nightmare at night. <laughs> I had to rewrite my entire menu without butter. I even remember I was under contract with PBS for my television show and Time Life for my new cookbook. I had to rewrite all the recipe in low-fat recipe. Huh. Thank goodness everybody came to their senses a few years later. Butter is a culinary tradition worldwide. With its high saturated fat content, it has raised concerns. Recent research have shown the potential health benefit of incorporated butter into your diet. Butter is more than just a source of uh, creaminess and richness in your favorite dishes. Butter is a nutritional powerhouse. Yeah, people don't know that. They think butter is bad. Butter is good. Let's talk about the surprising health benefit of eating and cooking with butter. Butter contains essential vitamins and minerals that supports um, our overall health. Butter is rich in soluble vitamins such as vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin E, and vitamin K. Those play a crucial role in your vision, bone health, and immune function. One of the key benefits of eating butter is the ability to enhance the absorption of nutrients from other food. My mom would say, it's like WD-40 for your body. It helps it. <laughs> Sounded terrible at the time, but it really is. Saturated fat, talking about saturated fat. You remember this article I mentioned it a few times in Time Life? That was not that long ago, 2014. I guess for some of you it's very long. The, the title, Time Life, Eat Butter. This is a new one, by the way, the old one. I, I, I gave it to so many people. Uh, anyway, Eat Butter, scientific, uh, sci scientist, can't read. Scientists label fat the enemy, why they were wrong. And in this article, then there is in there, it says in 2010, meta-analysts, basically it's a study of other studies, concluded that there was no significant evidence that saturated fat is associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular diseases. Those results were echoed by another meta-analyst published in March, March of the annual internal medicine, then drew nearly 80 studies involving more than a half a million subjects. So we know saturated fat gets a bad name and has been criticized, criticized in the past. And it is a very important part of butter. Some of the saturated fat present in butter include a particular type known for their positive effects such as, believe it or not, helping in weight reduction and inflammation. Really, apart from the health benefits, butter adds a delightful flavor and richness to a wide variety of dishes. Its creamy texture, its uniqueness, makes it popular choices around chefs all over the world. The evidence are obvious. Butter can be healthy choice when used in moderation. Butter as a rich nutritional composition includes essential nutrients that can be enjoyed as part of your balanced diet. In conclusion to this video, I'd like to quote Fernand Point, 
one of the old classic French chef who said, butter, butter, give me butter, always butter. Love you guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick video, this introduction. Then butter is good for you. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.